This is the weirdest video I've ever filmed. Hey guys, it's Jamie, and this is not going to be one of my usual funny, all energetic, and all extroverted videos and stuff like that. This is actually going to be more of a serious video, so my voice is going to be a little more just lower and just going to be talking regularly for this part. I have never done a story time video before today, so I'm excited to do my first one on my channel. So let's just get started and I'm going to tell you everything just off the bat, just as we start, so you guys aren't all confused about the titles. Don't worry. So it all started when my friend and I wanted to live on our own. And it wasn't any time near when I wanted to move out of New Jersey and go to California in the beginning of the year, which obviously isn't happening, but this was just one of those things that my friend and I wanted to do when we were younger, and we just wanted to, we were best friends, we still are best friends, we just don't talk as much as we used to, and we just wanted to live on our own. So we decided, <laughs> we decided that we wanted to make Sims, and if you guys don't know that game, The Sims 3, that's what we used. It's just an awesome, really, really addicting game, but it's a really fun game that we all, we both played together, um, and we played it at her house because she got a MacBook first, so I would just go over her house and we would play Sims. What we really wanted to do, our number one key thing, was to live on our own, and since we wanted to start um, ourselves just when we were younger, as babies. We wanted to start at the lowest age possible that you could when you were making Sims, so that would be a toddler because we didn't really have any parents. So we both went on Sims. Her name is Dana, and we were both at her house using her computer to go on Sims. And <laughs> we made each other, and then we filled in all the stuff that we wanted, so all of the clothing that we wanted, the little toddlers to have, and then we pressed OK because we were ready to live on our own. The little screen showed us something that said we needed to have an adult living with us. So then we made an adult and we called her Jenna Babysitter because Jenna was just the classic name that I thought of and then she went with it. So we made just me and Dana and then we had Jenna Babysitter. And we really didn't like Jenna Babysitter because we wanted to live on our own and just grow up by ourselves, but we had no choice. We needed to have a parent or a guardian, so I just stuck her in there and we were good to go. And we had a blast. We kind of just ignored Jenna Babysitter in the game that we're playing. Keep in mind, this isn't in real life at all. This is just on The Sims 3 game on the MacBook. So it was just the two of us having a lot of fun. We just kind of curled around and then as we started to mature, we grew into you know, elementary school students, I guess, and we did our homework, we were all good, Jenna did her own thing. And then it was time for us to be teenagers, so we had our birthday parties, and then we realized, wait, we don't need Jenna anymore, and we wanted to live on our own this entire time. So, we did something really bad, we actually trapped Jenna in a pool, um, we wanted to kill her. We wanted to get rid of her in some way, because we really just wanted to live on our own. That was the entire purpose of making the two of us, as toddlers, growing up together without any guardian. We took the food out of her inventory and we started to build a pool. And then we made a pool and put Jenna in it, put a gate around the pool, and that was that. She, the Grim Reaper, took her away. I feel like this is such a serious video since I'm talking about death and murder and stuff, but I promise you guys, it's all fake. It's just a very interesting story because I've told this to many of my friends, and I just bring up the topic like, oh hey, um, I killed my babysitter, and then they just go, what? Tell us the story. What actually happened? So that's what happened. Um, we killed her, we drowned her, we took all the food out of her dock, and that's pretty much it. We just grew up by ourselves, we both got, oh my gosh, I remember there was this guy he had the mohawk, I think he was he was Asian or something, he had the mohawk. I completely forget his name, it's been such a long time since I actually played The Sims. But we both grew up, we got married, we had kids, we lived in the same house. Pretty sure, I don't, it's been a while, I'm pretty sure we still have the game on her computer back at her house. But I just felt like sharing that story with you guys because I've told many of my friends and then I figured, hmm, a lot of people do story time videos, so I figured that'd be a good story. So that's the story of how I killed my babysitter. Um, <laughs> I feel so weird saying all this. If you guys liked it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. I promise you guys next week's video and the majority of videos on my channel, at least 99% of them, are not as horrendous, would you say? Horrific. Are not as horrific as this one. I just really wanted to share this story with you guys since I know I don't talk about my life that much, so 
yeah, there's a story. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, subscribe down below, and I will see you guys next week with a brand new video, and have a good day, and yeah. Go do something exciting. Go tell your friend a story that you haven't told her before or him, and just be extroverted. Be a good person, and I will talk to you guys soon, okay? Bye.